I know this is weird. I'm not in the Tesla, obviously. I'm in a minivan. I'm on vacation and you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. And today what we gotta do is try out this brand new drink from Starbucks. Hi guys, I'm Aria, welcome to my channel. So today we're doing another Starbucks video and we are trying out the brand new iced toasted vanilla oat milk shaken espresso. I'm very excited. I got up extra early today on my vacation to try this out for you guys and for myself because I want to know how it tastes. This literally, like I said, just came out today. I love vanilla and I love the brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso, which I also got. So I want to do a taste test of the toasted vanilla and then I want to do a one for one with the brown sugar to kind of see which one I like better, kind of give you guys some, some of my opinions and recommendations so that you can choose for yourself which one you want to drink. Let's read the description of what the Starbucks website says. So it's Starbucks Blonde Espresso, which we're already off to a great start because I love the Starbucks Blonde Espresso even better than the regular, so points for this drink. Combined with notes of caramelized vanilla shaken together and topped with oat milk for an energizing treat to boost your day. All of that sounds amazing. I love caramelized anything. I love vanilla. And like I said, I love Blonde Espresso. So the hopes are high. The hopes are high. Let's see if the drink can live up. Let's go ahead and give it a taste. And I did bring a fun little straw topper because why not? Why not make the drink more fun? All right, so here we go. First sip, first impression. Let's let's get it. Mmm. Okay, I really like that. I'm, I'm surprised because like I said, I wasn't sure what to expect. I've heard some mixed reviews from other people not liking it. I don't know what those people are on because I, I really like this. Maybe if you don't like vanilla, I I don't know. I think it tastes really good. I think it tastes really light. It's good. It tastes like vanilla. I mean, let, let me be real. It's not a super frilly, fancy drink. It tastes like vanilla with oat milk and espresso which is what it is so <laughs> I, don't, I feel like if you're going into it expecting something super fancy and over the top you're gonna be disappointed if you're going into it thinking I like oat milk and espresso throw some vanilla in there real quick that's what this is and I like it I think it's a really good like I said a light vanilla flavor with the oat milk mmm that's good. It tastes like, like I said, it tastes like vanilla oat milk with espresso in it. I don't know what's not to like. I'm, I'm giving this a 9 out of 10 because I think it's really good. Let's taste the brown sugar shaken espresso and see which one tastes better. Because I, I really, in general, like the brown sugar. It's not my favorite drink from Starbucks, but I like it. And in general, I like vanilla better than brown sugar, so... We'll see. Maybe I'll be getting this one more often. All right, we've got our brown sugar shaken espresso here. Mm. Also good. Also good. I just right off the bat, though, I'm gonna taste the other one again. Right off the bat, I like the vanilla better. I think that's because of my personal preference. They're both tasty, but in general, I'm always gonna go for vanilla over probably anything else. I even like vanilla ice cream. Okay, like I'm a vanilla girl. It's like one of my go-to flavors probably next to caramel that's probably the top choice for all of my coffee drinks but it goes like caramel and vanilla like they're very very close together so okay let's taste the vanilla again and then we'll taste the brown sugar together not together but like you know what i mean mm. yeah I, okay, I still stand by it. I like the vanilla one a little bit better. I think because the hint of cinnamon that's in the brown sugar one, I'm not a huge fan of. So if you like that, obviously stay with what you like. I personally like the vanilla one just a little bit better. Both good. You know, if they were out of vanilla, I would still get the brown sugar, but... I think the vanilla is going to be my go-to shaken espresso from now on. All right, guys, that's it for my review of the new toasted vanilla shaken what? I never got the name right because it's so long. Iced Toasted Vanilla Oat Milk Shaken Espresso at Starbucks. It, I thought it was really good. I think it's a very subtle sweetness. Again, if you go into it expecting something crazy with like 
packed punch of flavor, I think you're going to be disappointed. But on the same hand, if you like the brown sugar shaken espresso, I think you're also going to like this one because I think both of them are a little bit of a subtle sweet drink. They're not overpoweringly sweet, which I know normally not my thing. But every now and then, it's nice to have a little bit of sweetness. And I like the vanilla because, like I said, that's my favorite. And I love the blonde espresso. So I am a fan. I definitely recommend trying it out for yourself, especially if you like the brown sugar shaken espresso. I think give this version a try and see which one you might like better. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.